Peter is like so cool. My little pizza any time of day. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner, it's okay. The computer is a prototype for a vocal prosthesis, which Dr. Uhlenberg is working on, which will enable people with vocal impairment to communicate on the telephone. The working end is a typewriter and television screen and a speaker for the computer's voice. The mission last night was to order a pizza using the computer's voice. Handicapper Donald Sherman operated the machine while a small audience waited expectantly. Pizza. A large pizza, please. Pepperoni and mushrooms. Dominoes lost their chance to make history. Four tries later, someone chanced it and took the call seriously. Mr. Lennox, may I help you? I am using a special device to help me to communicate. Oh, okay. Sorry, we didn't understand what was going on. Please be patient while I prepare my responses. Yes. Oh, would you spell that? 
The order was confirmed and the pizza did arrive. So history has seen the first pizza being ordered by the first computer here at Michigan State University tonight. And it may not be very long before we'll all be able to use computers to communicate. So this is Maxine Parshall reporting for Channel 14 News with the CDC 6500 called Alexander. Say goodbye, Alexander. Goodbye, Alexander. Pizza is like so cool. I eat a pizza any time of day. Breakfast, lunch, and dinner, it's okay. I'll eat it hot, I'll eat it cold. Fresh from the oven or a couple of days, oh, because pizza rules. Pizza rule. Pizza rule. I truly believe that. Pizza rule. 